It's rookie camp season. Today we're going to be looking at the Kansas City Chiefs and we're going to get our first look at Xavier Worthy. We're going to look at him run through some drills, look at the clips from that. But before we do, you need to click that subscribe button right now because we're covering these rookie camps all rookie camp season long and then we're going to be jumping into mini camp season and then training camp season and you need to know what your players are doing behind the scenes. So click that button, stop missing out. We're going to go ahead and run the clips. A lot of them are the same, but from different angles because they're from different beat writers. But we're going to run through them a few times, talk ball and all that on Xavier Worthy here. So right now we're catching some punts, getting some work out in some special teams here. Probably will get some work there early in his career considering about how electric he is in space. I would want to, and it looks like they're using all the skilled players back there. See what they got in them. Now we're working on the hands, and there's a drop. However, that was a little high. We're working on feet anyways. Getting in and out of breaks. That one at the chest, looking good there. Back to the punts. Different beat rider. Here's another one. Showing some good hands there, getting upfield. We do not get to see his top end speed today, but we will see it later. Again, testing out the feet. Smooth on that last break. Honestly, training camp, we're just getting a look under the hood. Here at rookie camp, I mean. And they're trying to get to know their rookies. Rookies are trying to get to know their coaches. There's a drop. And that's what they're trying to do here at rookie camp. You're not going to see anything strenuous or crazy. You're going to see some of the basic stuff. Some basic routes. Some basic... Footwork drills, some pitch and catch, some pitch and catch workouts pretty much. But let's talk about Xavier Worthy. He's got 4-2 speed, can blaze it downfield, good after the catch. You can use him deep downfield, short to intermediate. You can move him around, you can use him on special teams. Rashi Rice might be facing a suspension, maybe, I don't know, allegedly, maybe, I don't know. Picked up Marquise Hollywood Brown. There were times during the season where the wide receiver depth chart was not looking good. And people were pegging them to draft the wide receiver in the first round prior to the pickup of Hollywood Brown. However, they still drafted Xavier Worthy. They felt like they still needed the depth. Sky Moore did not hit. Kadarius Tony has been Kadarius Tony. And this team could be massively explosive with an upgrade at the receiver position. Travis Kelsey, how much longer you got out of him? You should get a little bit more time, but I say a little bit more time. I'm not going to say years or anything like that. Father time does its thing, and I'm not going to jinx anybody. Xavier Worthy, though. Talking about his production profile here. Broke out at age 18 at Texas over a 20% market share of their passing production. Was one of only two wide receivers of the top wide receivers in this class. To do so, I'm talking about the guys who got drafted in top three to four to five rounds. All the key wide receivers. One of the top wide receivers in production when it comes to year one, years one, two, and three. Productive all three years out of college, especially from a market share standpoint. We blow up the combine. And this isn't like your John Ross. You go look at the tape, he can create separation. There has been an instance of drops, like we see here on tape, but it's not too egregious. And drops, if honestly some of the best wide receivers in football has had those issues, but but his ability to create separation, the elite speed creates a different dynamic for the offense. They need a breath of fresh air on the depth chart anyways. They had to make something happen. They saw what they saw on tape. They liked what they saw. The production metrics were there. He's got some upside. I can see where he can fit in offense. Very diverse. Will allow Patrick Mahomes to push the ball downfield a little bit more. Him, Hollywood Brown. And then use Rashi Rice a little bit deeper because he can command deep targets. He did that in college. And then if they want to play small ball, they can with Worthy. He's very dynamic. You can do both game plans with them you can move them around to slot outside put them everywhere mix and match them and he's gonna be a hard guy to cover because you gotta account for hollywood brown 
Then you got Rashi Rice. You got Travis Kelsey. So if you run a crosser with him, you got to count for Kelsey. You got to count for Brown. And you got Rashi there. You got everybody else too. That creates a different dynamic in the offense. Fantasy football-wise, you're seeing them go in the first round of rookie drafts. Anywhere between, depending on what you're talking about, 1QB or 2QB. 1QB, maybe like the third or fourth player off the board to middle to late portion of the first round. I've seen it all. 2QB, middle to late, really depends on who you're drafting with. He's a first rounder, legitly there. Some people are throwing him up the board due to him being on the Chiefs, the passing offense. You see that with every wide receiver getting draft capital with the Chiefs. Not really with Rashi Rice last year. He was quite the discount in the second round. Where these getting the bump up? I think that's fine. And a lot of people, it's him versus Roma Dunze. Let me know who you like better long-term production-wise. Xavier Worthy does have a lot of offense. Does have a lot of potential and upside for production. And is a great fit for this offense. I think you're going to see a lot of good stuff from him. I'm excited to see what we're going to see from training camp and mini camp. Let me know what you think about him in the comments below. Make sure to hit that subscribe button on the way out. One thank you for watching. Catch you on the next video.